Hello everybody, Shane here. Now this is going to be my entry to the 2016 Mother's Day Contest Challenge put on by me and Mom with YouTube channels of Shane's Hobby Shop and Know What Mom Knows. Alright, so this is what I got going on. This is going to be like a little planter box that Mom wanted me to build. Uh, I built her something last year out from Steve Ramsey's uh, plans. But honestly, they ain't going to be good enough for this year. So I'm just going to build her something plain and square just so she can put her uh, basil and her thyme and stuff like that into it. And uh, uh, just something real simple. It's what she wanted. So I'm going to build it for her Mother's Day gift. Now, I will have plans on my Facebook page for this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to be taking screenshots of this here. And plus, you see here... I got them knocked down into the sizes on what board they are color coded, you know, what the length of them is and the width are all four and a half inches wide, except for the legs. I'm going to be cutting those in, in apart to make nice square legs on them. And then your top trim, uh, those are going to be ripped down also. But the main boards are going to be four and a half inches wide. and I'm going to have all these pictures at JPEGs on my Facebook page just in case you wanted to make this yourself. But yeah, this is it right here. Alright, so let's go ahead and build this and well, let's get started. Alright, see you then. Okay, after you get everything cross-cutted to your dimensions, let's go ahead and take the ones that are 2 foot, 10 and 3 quarters. Take two of them at a time. And I'm going to be joining the edges. So let's go ahead and rip these real clean on the table saw. I could go do the joiner, but I'm just going to go ahead and do the table saw since I'm here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, rip these nice and clean on the joints because I got some biscuits. I went and got me a an old biscuit joiner, five dollars at a garage sale. Can't beat that. So I went and bought me some biscuits, and I'm gonna try and biscuit these joints together. That's gonna be the the, the front and the back, the front and the back and the bottom, and also the sides too. So let's go ahead and clean up those edges, and let's go ahead and join them together with biscuits. All right? Let's do that. Alright, welcome back to the next day. Uh, I didn't have that many clamps, so I had to glue up all of these boards, uh, literally one at a time, or should I say two at a time. But I went ahead and got them all glued up. I'm not going to worry about sanding it because it's just going to be a planter box for mom, and uh, she don't even want to paint it, but I might paint the outside just to get rid of some of these stains that are on the board. So, uh, I wanted to do this just outside, but it's very windy today, and you already know what happens when I take my camera outside on a windy day. I'm not going to do that again. So we're going to begin here. I'm going to go ahead and do this up, and then we're going to work on the back.
Alright, the box is made, so now let's move on to the sides. Okay, what I'm going to do for the legs, I'm going to be uh, setting my table saw at a 45 degree angle and then set my fence up at 2 inches off of that. And I'm going to run these both ends down, that way I'll get a 2 inch uh, grip at a 45 degree angle. Okay, let's do that. Okay, this is just a box I made. Uh, actually, I was trying out a box joint that I just got. And so, I'm actually going to use this to help put together the legs. What we got is all of these at 45 degree angle. I'm going to go ahead and put one on top, one on the side here, nail, and glue them together. All right, there you go. A completed uh, planter for the Mother's Day contest. A present to my wife, Shelly, who is no at my nose. Yeah, I know it's not really a good Mother's Day present, but that's what she wanted. She wanted a planter to put all her herbs in. You see, she has a couple of basils and thyme and I don't know what all else in there, but she had a couple different plants and she wanted something real nice to put it in. Up front there you see you've got a couple of rosemary and I think even a lavender plant. On the outside porch I got my, my tomato plants and I think uh, Brussels sprouts on the outside there. But uh, yeah, there you go. My completed video for the Mother's Day 2016 contest. Alright, if you like my video, please give me that thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that su subscribe button if you haven't already. My name is Shane, and this is Shane's Hobby Shop, and we'll see you next time.